Economically disadvantaged youths in Port Moresby have been given employment opportunities through a youth employment service program. The program was officially launched yesterday by the Brave Security Consortium in Port Moresby. Brave Security Consortium funded this program with an aim to provide training and employment opportunities, especially for this group of young people in the city. Stella Martin reports. Brave Security Consortium was established three months ago through the Sustainable Crime Prevention Program to prevent youths from engaging in crimes. The company focuses on training and employing economically disadvantaged youths. Its managing director, Wesley Roy, says they hope to train the youths to become professional security guards. So our target group or the focus is for economically disadvantaged youth, uh, age 18 to 30. So anyone less than 18, uh, come down below 18, we won't recruit them. And above 30, we won't recruit and train them. So those who are youths who are out of job and out of school have no job exposure and they have no um, uh, job experience and also uh, they haven't completed their studies well or they dropped out or they failed. Those are the people that we are targeting to help them. So what I'm doing is uh, I'm trying to give them the skills uh, necessary for make them employable, not only with us but uh, they can market themselves after getting the skills and training. So. Under this program, Brave Security Consortium will recruit 30 youths on a monthly basis to undergo training to be qualified as professional security guards. Mr. Roy says by employing the youths, they hope to break the cycle of crime, unemployment and poverty in the country. The executive director of Bible Translation, Baton Minor, who was the keynote speaker at the launch, says the program was an opportunity for youths to give themselves a second chance in life. This is an opportunity for you. Uh, this is a platform where you can come and be able to give yourself a chance. I think chances come only once. And when the chance is given to us, we need to take advantage of that, make best use of that chance, and make the best use of that chance to enhance our lives. And also for you to contribute to the development, not only for yourself and your family, but for the development of this nation. Speaking on behalf of the 30 Youth Security Officer, Simon Angili commended Brave Security Consortium for this great initiative. Stella Martin, NBC National News, Port Mosby.